HDR stands for High Dynamic Range, which means it can capture clearly both the bright part and dark part. It is to take a few photos with different exposures at one time, and then automatically synthesize a photo according to the algorithm. Usually when you take a picture of a building, when the building is focused well, the sky will be overexposed. But with the HDR, you can get a more detailed photo which exposed both the dark side and bright side, so you can see the details of all the shadows. First we need to open the camera app. Enable the HDR option. Keep the phone stable and take shoot. This feature is applicable for shooting a wide range of scenery, back lightning, or the scenery that is very different in brightness. The tip of HDR photography of iPhone is to keep the phone stable. If the phone is shaken or the object is moving, you will get a blurred photo. As we all know, the flashlight can strengthen the exposure to ensure that the picture is clear in low light conditions. You can only get a dark photo with many noises. However, when you turn on the flashlight, there are more details. Open the camera app. Enable the flash option. Hold still and take a shoot. This feature often used for a low light environment. When there's complicated background at low light, you can also use flash to highlight your object. The flashlight can also be used at day hours to highlight people and make them more vivid. Tip for using flashlight, do not focus on the eyes or eyeglasses at low light environment because it will be reflective and make people seem horror. If you like this video, make sure you give me a thumb up. Thanks for watching. See you guys around.